On the shores of Lake Michigan, in the city of Milwaukee, billions of workers help clean wastewater before it's returned to the lake. That's right, billions of workers. You can't see them, but they're hard at work every day here at the Milwaukee Metropolitan Sewerage District's Jones Island Wastewater Treatment Plant. There are four basic stages to the wastewater treatment process. Screening, settling, secondary treatment, and disinfection. It's here in secondary treatment where our billions of workers come into the picture. They're microscopic organisms or bugs that eat and break down organic material in wastewater. If you look through a powerful microscope, some of them look like this, others like this. They're the workhorses of wastewater treatment in a process known as activated sewage sludge. The bugs here at Jones Island are actually famous, known around the United States by master gardeners, golf course superintendents, and homeowners. They all use Melorganite organic nitrogen fertilizer made from the microscopic organisms here at Jones Island. But getting from here to here takes a lot of work. After the bugs finish their job here in secondary treatment, they move to a settling tank where they're removed from the treatment system. Next step, a trip through the thickening process where we add a polymer to get the bugs to stick together or start clumping so they're easier to handle. From here, the thickened water mass moves to the $200 million drying and dewatering building. At the filter presses, we add more agents to thicken this microbial stew. We use a fabric filter to press water out of the bugs, a process that produces the look of wet cardboard. That cardboard-like material is then dried out using massive dryers that tumble the material while removing even more moisture. To kill off any live pathogens, the bugs are heated to a core temperature of 185 degrees. The hot melorganite is cooled, screened, and shipped off to storage. We can store up to 10,000 tons of melorganite in silos, with each one holding a different grade depending on customer needs. Rail cars or trucks transport bulk melorganite to our packaging contractor, or it's transported directly to customers throughout the United States and Canada. Every day, the quality of melorganite is checked by scientists to make sure it meets or exceeds regulatory requirements. Through the work of many employees, we can ensure that Melorganite 620 is a high-quality fertilizer, consistent from bag to bag and year to year. For more information on how to best use Melorganite on fairways, lawns, gardens, or flowers, go to Melorganite.com. That's Melorganite.com. Melorganite. For better results, naturally.